up YouTube? It is your boy Tim coming back at you with another YouTube video and welcome to TA Vlogs. If this is your first time stopping by my channel, I would like to say welcome. And if you guys could, please hit the subscribe button, hit that like button. All of that does help out the YouTube algorithm and it helps boost my video to more and more people. So thank you to every single one of you guys that do that on my videos. And for today's video, we're going to be comparing two sneakers. One being the Yeezy 350 Beluga Reflective versus the Yeezy 350 Beluga 2.0. So we'll start off with this one, this one being the newer release. This one released about two weeks ago. And this is a retro of the original Beluga that released back in 2016. This is the Yeezy Beluga 2.0s and this is a remake of the first model uh, releasing in 2017. And this Yeezy is actually my first Yeezy in my collection. So this one has a lot of sentimental value in my collection. But let's go over some of the similarities and some of the differences. So we have both shoes right here. The 2.0 being on my left hand and the reflective original model being on my right hand. So both are all over gray shoes with orange hits. Um, both have the same translucent outsoles with the Yeezy boost on the bottom. So one of the main differences, as you guys can see, is that big orange stripe. So with the 2.0, they basically took out the orange stripe, made it a gray stripe, and just kept the orange Supply 350. And this one has the big orange stripe with the Supply 350 in the gray color. Another big difference between the two shoes is this pull tab on the heel. The 2.0 has the pull tab versus the original Yeezy 350 did not have that. The grays are a little bit different. Um, I don't know if because this one being a little bit older than this one just being brand new. Um, this gray seems a little bit lighter. This one seems a little bit darker. So that's kind of a difference. Um, the stripes are different as well. The stripes on the Beluga 2.0 are darker versus this one's a lot lighter. And one of my favorite parts about the Yeezy Beluga 1.0s is that you have that orange hits throughout. So you have it throughout the whole uppers. There's a whole bunch of orange specks going throughout the shoe. Something this one is lacking. This one is just basically gray all over with a little bit of orange, but this one has a lot more hits of orange throughout the shoe, not just the stripe, uh, but going throughout the whole fly knit uh, upper. The laces are different on both of the shoes. So this one just has plain gray laces versus this one has gray and darker gray, which is the 3M hits throughout the laces. So that's a plus on that. And I would probably say one of the biggest differences is that this one is reflective and this one is just a plain old Yeezy. And the shape to the uppers are a little bit different. This one is being worn a lot, so I can't really judge that too much. But as you can see for the heel portion, um, this one kind of has a little boop right here and it comes out. And this one has that same boop, but this is a little bit higher, I feel, than the 2.0s. Um, this 1.0 has a little bit of a higher upper. Insoles for both of them are the same. Um, padding around the ankle is the same, so that is the same on that. Now, let's get into pricing. For the Beluga 2.0, the retail was $220, and right now resale is sitting anywhere between $500 to $600. And for this Yeezy 350 Beluga 1.0 Reflective, retail was actually a little bit higher because of the reflective material. It was $240 and resale is sitting anywhere between $350 to $400. Bucks. So this one is newer and cheaper. Overall guys, both are great shoes. Both are super similar and both are probably staying in my collection if I can be honest with you guys. Um, I definitely want to have the original right here um, in my collection and this one is just so sentimental being the first Yeezy in my collection but this one is going to be in my rotation instantly. Alright guys, that's going to wrap up the video. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to smash that like button, make sure to hit the subscribe button and make sure to comment down below which one you guys like more, the Beluga 2.0 or the Beluga 1.0 Reflective that just recently released. Make sure to check me out on Instagram and TikTok at Rotato Chip. Both of those links will be down in the description box below. And Happy New Year to all. A lot of fire content coming out on the way. I got three more videos I'll be uploading within the next week or two. So make sure to stay tuned to all that fire content. It's been your boy Tim, signing out. Peace.